What sand boa? Where's the sand boa? <laughs> what sand boa? The sand boa's not in here. Hey, what's going on everybody? Well, we are back for another video today and uh, this is going to be a special video. So I know not everybody has seen this, but Brenton and I have been in somewhat of a prank war over the last couple of weeks. And I mean, it has gone from everything from him hiding on the roof of my house and egging me when I came home to putting my trash cans inside and I, I like all kinds of things. Well, the other day I noticed Christian, which is Brenton's friend, you can find him over on the Fanatic channel. So I noticed Christian was talking to Pyro Toad, who is the kid that helped me build the epic paludarium that I have. And he was talking to him about this rescue sandbow and how much he wanted it. I didn't tell Christian that I reached out to Pyro Toad behind his back and was trying to convince Pyro Toad to give me the sandbow boa just as a joke. Well, today we were out filming the video you'll see on the Fanatic channel of us trying to figure out how to build a boat to get to our new private island. When we were done with that, they asked me if they could go off and do something because they needed to go take care of something on their own and they said it was a surprise. So I'm like, I wonder what this is. Well, Christian was talking to Pyro Toad and they were planning on coming over here and getting the sand boa today. So what did I do? I called Pyro Toad. I set it up and look at this. I'm at his house right now and we're about to take this sand boa and Christian has no idea. And when he shows up, what's going to happen i'm gonna tell him i lost it You're, he's gonna tell him that he I, lost i've had experiences with losing snakes before so, so it's just another, another, it's just another lost snake yeah. so yeah brenton christian sorry guys but i'm sorry uh, I, I truly I, am i'm a double I, agent here he is a double agent dude do you know how many people they had turned on me i mean my own son max really? max yeah. turned on me so we're gonna get in here and we're gonna get this sand boa but i gotta give thanks to christian again of course this this christian pyro toad yeah. because uh yeah without him this would not be happening make sure you go subscribe check out his 30 plus reptiles in his reptile room we'll do a little mini tour before we walk out but let's get the sand bow and get it home before yeah. christian and brenton get here because they're on their way right now is that them oh, no. well this is the pretty little sand boa that christian thinks he's on his way to get and this thing is amazing. Well, have they texted you to let you know they're on their way? Oh, not that I'm aware of you. I checked about five minutes ago. Well, while we're, um, you know, here, let's take a quick little tour. You want to, uh, you want to give everybody a tour? Got some Amazon monkey frogs up, up in the corners here. You can see one up there and one at the top. Those guys are from the Amazon. No. Um, they're, they're gorgeous. Wait, they're Amazonian milky frogs from the Amazon? And, yeah. That is dope. Yeah. So people get mad because they're called, well, I call them milky frogs, but they're actually called milk frogs, but the Y doesn't really make a difference. Um, and they're in this beautiful, gorgeous bio set up kind of like what we set uh, Christopher Scott's cage up in just not the whole waterfall how, how is your cage doing my dude it's absolutely amazing yeah. like my bronze or I have pups on every one of my already bronze. yeah really crazy that's right? crazy awesome. so I have, I have pups on every one of my bronze I'm about to have to trim my fern because it's almost all the way to the top no way yes. that fast yes that's it's crazy. crazy well at least it's yeah. established it is that's awesome so this is really what you would consider a terrarium Right. Correct, yeah. But it does look cool. I mean, like, it's super well, sick, it's still, right? Well, it's still under construction. I still got to tuck a lot of that stuff back there up. It's nowhere near finished yet. Gotcha. I'm going to get some dark frogs for that, so that'll be pretty awesome. Okay. Uh, and here, you, are, you guys already know. I always got to oh, show Oh, I know off. what this is. Yeah, this is... Gucci has her own beach ball. Yeah, she has her own... She likes to take a bath, go swim, so she's got a beach ball to swim with. Exactly. Come here, Come here stop. Oh, my God. Here's our big girl. Look at this thing. That's my hand compared that to That is amazing. That is crazy. What a beast. Say hi, Gucci. Oh my gosh, Gucci. Let's get her better lighting. Like I will tell you, Gucci, you are one look at, fat look at her cow eyes. of a turd. Yeah, she's a I monster. Mean, she is a monster. Yep. Like I saw her straight, just yeah. toad like her can mm. take down a full alligator. So it is, that's because of the poison, right? Correct. Okay. Correct. And that's secreted from the what gland? The parotid gland. The parotid gland. Two bumps gland. between, uh, like in the yeah. shoulder region. Which is essentially we've talked about this before. That's like when a dog gets a normal. What are those normal toads in their mouth? Yeah. It causes them to foam and Correct. That yeah. Kind of so, thing. but just nowhere near as bad. This will kill the dog. Oh Older my gosh! Point. I see a fish in there. Yeah, I've got some rosy red minnows. Look at that! Yeah, I that is crazy. Yeah. Oh, there's a brown and all in there. There's actually three. There's a baby and two adults, but you're not going to be able to find them because they are everywhere. They get up in behind the background and down in the plants. Yeah, um, I gotcha. Maybe we'll see them later. Yeah, that's cool. A pastel ball python down here. Fully grown male, and he's uh, absolutely gorgeous. And over here, we've got a an adult male corn snake. I'll get him out for you guys real quick. see him back there. Look at that. He's about four feet. Look at that. Pretty sweet snake. He's gorgeous. Look at his bottom. Oh, wow. It fades. I'm working on getting more animals, of course. We got some a crested gecko up here, an adult, or an almost adult female. Pac-Man frog somewhere in the dirt. See, a lot of them are all hidden. 
fire belly good. toad, a male fire belly toad. The other male is probably under the ledge somewhere or hiding. Now these fire belly toads we've talked about maybe going that with that in our in the paludarium Correct. setup, right? So Correct. those are pretty awesome. Yeah, they're actually really pretty. Oh yeah. So that's uh, what do you guys think? So on my channel, do you think fire belly toads would be great in the paludarium for the terrestrial area? Now obviously they get into the water as well. Of course, yeah. They're gonna so, definitely spend a lot of time in the water, a large majority of their time. That's why I have their setup like that here. okay yeah uh, over here we got a tomato frog i love tomato frogs i don't even know what a tomato frog is but don't. i don't does it look like a tomato yes it does that is amazing red or green tomato a red tomato oh uh, that does look like a tomato yeah. frog look at that thing he's gorgeous he these like guys will actually uh, secrete a glue like substance out of their skin and if a predator wants to eat them their jaws could sometimes get glued shut so it, it, wow. it's really interesting yeah it's very rare and he's never you know done it with me or anything like that but they can still do it i've got a leopard gecko down here i've got another crested gecko I can get so him once on. again make sure you subscribe to pyro toad because he's helping me out with this prank here and check out his stuff i mean he's got all kinds of animals and definitely make sure you come check him out all right well brenton and christian are here so i gotta get out of here but yes i'm taking the sand boa and we're leaving for me you got to be a good actor okay well we got the snake we are getting out of here and uh yeah they're not here yet which is good so i have to avoid them Oh no, I'm not going to, so I'm gonna go, basically what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna head out, I'm gonna head down here, I'm gonna take a ride into your neighborhood, I'm gonna go to the next adjacent street. Fun fact, while I'm sitting here editing this video, I had to stop and just play this real quick. What caught them off guard was they actually watched Pyro Toad's footage and they heard me say that I was gonna drive over and park on the adjacent street and neither Brenton or Christian could figure out what adjacent meant. <laughs> So they couldn't find me. And I'm looking over at Brenton and he's just looking at me shaking his head like, oh my God. Okay. And I'm gonna wait until they get oh, here. Really? So when they get here, you need to let me know. All right, hey, and uh, let's get back together. So we're gonna actually film another video together because okay, I yeah. think that we're gonna put in some frogs and a crested gecko into the paludarium. It is nice and cycled, the water is, so I can put some fish in there. Yeah, so they have no idea that I'm here. They have no idea that I've picked up this snake. They have no idea I'm taking this snake. Little Christian there is going to actually played off as if the snake got out of the enclosure and he doesn't know where it's at so we'll see you back at the house so I just talked to pyro toad and they have officially shown up at the house so right about now they're finding out that this snake has disappeared somewhere inside of their house now what pyro toad is supposed to be doing is actually getting them to help him look for it which is even funnier because they're looking for a snake that is right there in that little container. Sorry, Christian, sorry, Brenton, but that's what happens when you uh, when you mess with me. So uh, yeah, we'll see you back at the house, buddy. The what? Where's the what? Where's the sand boa? What sand boa? Where's the sand boa? <laughs> what sand boa? The sand boa's not in here. The funny thing is, is you ready for this? Oh, listen, listen, get back. It's not in here. 